Energy go! Ra, 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 ra. Good morning, Ephrata High School. I'm Edwin Crockett. And I'm Jeff. Today is Wednesday, April 25th. Get up your chairs, rise for a pledge of the flag, and a moment of silence. Do you like going to school events? Do you like taking photos? Well, then you should consider joining the Cloisterette Yearbook. Starting May 1st, the club will resume their Tuesday meetings in Mr. Jeremy Bischoff's room. Woo! 318 to work on the spring edition. Any students who wish to participate in next year's book should attend. They will learn all about taking pictures, captioning, and the whole yearbook process. See you there. Attention 9th and 10th grade students planning to attend college or other post-secondary school. We will be hosting a spring financial aid night, not for the am but the school in partnership with the Pennsylvania Higher Education Assistance Agency on Thursday May 10th from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. in the EHS auditorium come to learn more about career exploration post-secondary planning and student borrowing don't forget to bring your laptop and your parents for some odd reason always forget my parents this is a great opportunity to start planning for your future today attention freshmen that's right freshman just one because Dr. Gambler will not be here today, the no-sub sale is being extended through this Friday. Yay! That's April 27th. Remember, after this date, if you have not returned anything to room 214, your name will be added to the obligation list and you'll never graduate. You'll be here forever. <coughs> and ever and ever. Forever. Return your form, money, and your form, or $2 to avoid being placed on the obligation list. Now over to 3F Jeff with the news. You know, the dishonest media, they'll say... Ah! French, French President Emmanuel Macron is currently in Washington, D.C., visiting Donald Trump and discussing the future of cooperation between France and the United States. Topics of discussion include military actions in Syria, transatlantic trade, and potentially attempting to renegotiate the Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action, more commonly known as the Iran nuclear deal. Although Trump and Macron have only hinted at the possibility of renegotiating, renegotiating the JCPOA, top Iranian officials, included, including, including President Rouhani and the Atollah Khamenei, uh, stated publicly that there would be severe consequences if the U.S. attempted to withdraw from the deal. Dun, dun, dun. Today we celebrate the birthday of jazz legend Ella Fitzgerald. This influential singer was born in 1917, and she is also known as the First Lady of Song on account to her incredible voice. Fitzgerald overcame an incredibly troubled childhood, which included losing both parents during the middle of the Great Depression. Despite being described as very shy, she was a civil rights activist and broke her barriers whenever she performed. Happy birthday. Now back to the main desk with lunch. Check out the new simple strawberry smoothie, brownie parfaits, and cold brewed coffee. Available in a snack room. That was really slow. Chick, yo, for lunch today we got a chicken nugget with a whole grain roll and margarine. The bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich. You got that Italian hoagie. You got taco salad. French fries. Red pepper strips with dip. Fresh broccoli, dip, assorted fruit, or slushy. Now we're to sports. In sports resorts, boys lacrosse won 17-5 at Conestoga Valley, girls lacrosse lost 17-7 versus Conestoga Valley, and we don't have a score from softball at Exeter, but I'm sure Raquel Hackman played well. Today in sports, baseball is away at Hempfield and softball is home versus Hempfield. Now back to the main couch. Gerald, you can't say anything. You don't have the talking skull yet. No. Give me the, give me the, there we go. Got my buddy. Pick on a Senior Day is coming up. It will be held on May 11th, the day before prom. It's a Friday, just in case you were wondering. Here's your chance to bid on one of the seniors and dress them in the most creative way possible. Bidding will be held in the cafeteria during your lunch from April 24th through May 8th. Seniors who choose to participate should sign up during lunch. If you have any questions, stop down to see Mr. Marzak in room 137. 
at this point, I am to show you. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Okay. There's a lot of banging going on next door. You know, media center being renovated. Yeah. At this point, I'm supposed to show you these papers and. Um... Wait. Oh, guys. Yeah. It won't. I don't care. We hope to see everyone wearing purple and yellow today to represent stomach, bladder, and bone cancer. And then I show some spirit days on the screen. Oh yeah, I have the talking skill now. The Relay, life, the Relay for Life is today. If you have not donated yet, there is still time. We hope everyone enjoys walking today to find a cure and beat cancer. I enjoy walking every day, so. Now let's watch this video about today's event.
simple way that you would expect, like it didn't get an unusual edge to it or turn colors or anything. super serious, but she lost almost her entire heel.